Hey everybody and welcome to this video. I'm Inkslaura123 and this is going to be a shopping haul video. So today I went out with Nathan and we had our little exercise walk and we nipped into a couple of shops. So I thought I would do a video and show you what I got. Okay, so uh, before we start with what's inside the bags, um, I just want to show you the new tote bag that we got. I know, I know I said I wouldn't get any more tote bags but well, you know, we did need one, to be fair. So, <laughs> look at this, though. It's a licorice all sorts tote bag. Oh, my God. I love this bag. It's so cool. So, yeah, this is from Poundland. It's a brand new tote bag. They do some really great tote bags. Um, it's quite big as well. I mean, look how much stuff you can get in it. But, yeah, this is very exciting for me. Um, random fact, but when I was a kid, I used to have um, a jumper with this design on it. My grandma, bless her, she knitted me uh, a jumper sweater um, of like the licorice all sorts design. So anyway, that's just a random fact for you. I think I've got photos of me wearing it. I don't know. Anyway, right. <laughs> Let's get on with this shopping haul. Uh, if you enjoy watching, <laughs> the llama's just staring right at you, looking into your soul. Um, yeah, if you enjoy watching this video, please click like, comment, subscribe to my channel. That would be awesome and don't forget to uh, check out my other channel links laura 123 asmr link is down below okay i'm gonna stop rambling and get into these bags and just kind of get everything out and show you what i have got okay so we're starting this bag and what is this one? Oh, this is my my unicorn bag i like this one um also from poundland so these are actually not for myself they are to sell on ebay because um i've heard through the grapevine um that <laughs> whatever i don't know why i did that but anyway i've heard through the grapevine that you um you can sell these for quite a good amount so well we'll see i'll, I'll probably put them on ebay and like make 50p but you know it's worth a try they're only a pound each um and this is the llama they are posters and they're quite big they're a3 size and um yeah apparently these are going really well so um this one's the llama and this one is, as you can see, the pineapple. Pineapples are so on trend, like, all the time. You always see pineapple stuff everywhere. So, um, yeah, they are going to be going on my eBay. So look out for that if you're on uh, my eBay. They are going to be on there. It's Minx Laura on eBay. Um, okay, right. So next up. Now, <laughs> this is, like, really weird to show in a video. I don't think I've ever shown this in a video before. Um, but these are for the toilet. Oh, yeah. So my mum said to me, um, can we pick these up? She can't go out of the house. She's not allowed. She's over 70 with, like, ongoing health conditions and stuff. So she can't get out. So um, we ask her, obviously, every time we have to go out if she needs anything. And this is what she asked for. And I was like, okay. Um, but they are good. You hook them in the toilet. And, obviously, every time it flushes and stuff, it cleans the toilet. And it gives a nice smell. Um, so we've got the Domestus one. This is the pink magnolia. Uh, this is supposed to smell... Really, really nice, maybe. Um, and you also got the Harpic uh, Fresh Power 6, which looks like it has kind of citrusy summer breeze uh, smell. So basically, when you have a wee or a poo, it's going to smell like oranges. So, you know. Uh, but yeah, they're a pound each from Poundland. Mummy uh, will be well happy with those. And, and moving on, this is also for the toilet. Now you're going to think we've all got issues, but... <laughs> well, no, we like a nice smelling bathroom you know uh, this is febreze air freshener and it is a vanilla blossom who loves the smell of van uh, vanilla let me know in the comments section i oh, i love the smell of vanilla so much so and febreze is a really really good make i love febreze products and um, the smell kind of lingers for ages and it is 100 percent natural um so yeah that is from poundland that was two pound that wasn't a pound it was two pound but as you can see it's quite a big one who her misses, but um, yeah, it's a big, it's a big one. Um, okay, right. Next up, this is from Boots. Um, where we are in South End, the Boots, the chemist is right next door, Poundland, basically. Um, so I nipped into Boots as well. So I picked up the uh, Dettol original soap, and this is really, really good stuff. The only thing I don't like about it is it's yellow, um, and it's kind of staining um, parts of the sink bright yellow. I mean, you can obviously clean your sink and it comes off, but it's just a bit annoying seeing all these like like yellow marks all over the sink so um anyway but it's really good obviously for your hands and nice and clean because it's Dettol gets rid of all the germs and stuff like that so uh, and it's got quite a nice smell as well actually um I picked up my mum the shower gel this is a Sanex Dermo Hypoallergenic there we go I hope I said that right and um 
yeah, she needs this because her skin's really, really, really sensitive and stuff. And it's, uh, I don't think it's scented. It's just like a natural shower gel, sensitive skin. Um, that we, there you go. Look, no colorants and soap minimizes the risk of irritation uh, because sometimes her skin gets a bit. Mm, so she has to have like a special shower gel for her skin. So that's that. That's from Boots. Right, I've got a pot noodle. Pot noodle. This is from Poundland, 50p. Absolute bargain. They're doing their pot noodles for 50p, like a big old box of them. You can just choose your flavour. I chose chicken and mushroom. Um, be a heroic. Um, can I just say, for anyone who comments, they're not vegetarian because it's chicken and mushroom. It is vegetarian. Um, it says somewhere here. There we go. Look. Ha-ha. Because, -ha. Um, yeah, I've done this before. I say how much I love pot noodles, and then you get someone commenting going, you shouldn't be having those. They're not vegetarian. Eh. Actually, they are. So it's not real chicken. It's just like soya, fake chicken and, and flavorings and stuff. So um, I can have it because it's fine. So, yeah, got that. 50p, though. What a bargain. Now, this is probably really, really unhealthy and fattening. And I just really wanted it <laughs> because it looks delicious. Obviously, I'm not going to eat the whole tub in one sitting. I mean, look how big it is in my hand. Um, but it does look tasty. I've never tried it. But um, it's called Nutsy, a smooth chocolate and hazelnut spread. So basically, it's like a fake Nutella. And I love Nutella so much. Um, and I just thought I'd give this one a go. So we'll see. It might be nicer than Nutella. It might not be nice. We don't know. Um, now, Poundland do this cool thing um, where they charge, I think it's pound. Yeah, pound for two cans. You can just select whatever can you wanted. Um, so I've got this Dr. Pepper for Nathan. He likes the Dr. Pepper. And this is mine as well. This is the Dr. Pepper Zero. Um, I only drink zero drinks or like diet drinks. This is a zero sugar, zero calories. Dr. Pep. Dr. Pepper. Uh, let me know in the comments section if you like Dr. Pepper. Random question, but there we go. Now, um, I'm going to show you these, but I'm going to be actually doing a whole separate video with these bad boys. Um, I'll tell you a little bit about them in this video, but watch the actual video. Um, I'm going to do it in a few days. So uh, these are solar flame lights, a flickering effect. And they're from Poundland. They were five pound. Um, but I'll tell you what it is really quickly. So um, sometimes at night when me and Nathan are watching TV, we just flick through the shopping channels. Uh, I know it's a bit sad to confess that, but there we go. That's what we do. Um, it's very relaxing, actually, <laughs> watching all the shopping channels. Anyway, but they sell some like random stuff. Most of the stuff's a bit meh, you know. But we saw these on a show the other day and they look so freaking amazing they literally look like flames all it up they're solar powered there's not like it's just magic it's magic it lights up like a fiery flame um, i think they need to charge in the sun for like six hours or so and then they light up so um, basically on qvc they were expensive so i thought oh i'll check on ebay and they were expensive on there as well but um on here they were only uh, five pounds so I've got two of them the last two there in fact and I'm going to do a video and kind of talking more about them in detail and showing you um our garden putting them in the garden and obviously hoping if they work uh, to show you them all lit up and stuff so I'm quite excited about this uh, but these are the exact ones that I, I wanted so um yeah I managed to get those and these little bits here they just kind of uh, twist onto the end and they poke in to the earth that's just a bottle of water um, that was mine anyway. I always have to have a drink of water with me when I'm out and about. Anyway, so yeah, I'm really excited about the solar ones. They had lots of different solar lights and stuff in Poundland. So uh, if that's your thing, let me know and, uh, you know, tell me what sort of solar lights you like. Uh, do you like the coloured ones or do you like these kind of flame effect ones or, you know, just plain colour? Let me know. All right, so next up, I've got this Cuticura hand sanitizer gel, antibacterial um yeah I, i'm always picking these up you know because they're so hard to get hold of so when i see them i get them i've kept a few in my drawer now and uh obviously every time i'm going out i'm washing my hands constantly with this kind of stuff and they're going down so each time i like run out of one i i replace it in my bag but this is a cute cura original one so it's, it's a good brand from the boots so i'm gonna move over to oh actually no it won't do that because i'll crush my new solar light let's move these out the way I'm so not organised, am I? OK, 
Okay, so um, this is what my mum asked for as well. These are these little uh, microwave containers so she can store different, like she makes soup and she makes different bits and pieces, I don't know. And she, she stores them in these. Um, so she wanted some of those. Got those, that's an eight pack there. Um, oh, so I've got more drink as well as the two for one um, offer. Oh no, that's not that. Hold on, where's the other one? So we've got another... Dr Pepper for Nathan and I got myself Lilt Zero. Who doesn't like a bit of Lilt? So this is pineapple and grapefruit. So delicious. I love Lilt and to be honest, like Lilt Zero tastes exactly the same as normal Lilt but obviously it's better for you. Um, I also picked up this drink here in my local sweet shop. This is uh, an American cream soda but it's uh, got no caffeine in it and I thought I could do a video trying it because I liked that last video where I did um, taste testing on that uh, weird cola, green cola. Um, so, yeah, I thought I could try an actual uh, cream soda. And just, I'm probably doing it in future videos as well, like trying different uh, drinks and foods and stuff. So I picked that up. Also, I got some baby cotton buds to clean those ears. Um, it's quite a big pot, actually. Only a pound in Poundland. And, uh, yeah, they, they are good. Always clean my ears. My ears are feeling really weird at the moment, especially my right ear because I've got um, really horrible hay fever and it affects my, my ear. Anyway, I <laughs> just thought I'd share that information with you. Um, next up, I've got some honey, um, blossom honey. This is just from Poundland. Um, it's just honey, really. There's not really much you can say about it. But apparently, we read uh, last night online that um, for hay fever, honey is actually really good. So I'm I'm trying anything now. Honey is also good, like if you've got a bit of a sore throat and stuff like that. So um, yeah, it's good to either have on its own on a, on a spoon, or maybe you can add it into like a herbal tea or something like that. Or you can have it with like just warm water and drink it that way. And yeah, so I picked up some honey. I'm going to be making a video, by the way, about hay fever and some uh, kind of like home remedies for hay fever um, and also like different foods and drinks that could help people because, you know, I'm not the only one suffering. Other people have got hay fever too, so I want to help others because I'm so nice. <laughs> so, uh, anyway, right, next up I've got this KA uh, steel pineapple drink. Now, if you've ever had the fizzy KA pineapple, you'll know how delicious it is. Oh, my God, it's so nice. But I've never tried the steel pineapple, and I thought I'd give it a go because also, like the honey, uh, it did say online that pineapple, um, all kind of vitamin C drinks, uh, especially pineapple, though, um, are good for hay fever, as is apple juice. So I picked up a little apple juice as well. Um, I love drinking little fruit juice. I try and have, like, orange juice or apple every single day. Uh, right, this is our little treat. Oh, look at this. It's a big old box. Uh, these are from Poundland. They're from Brompton House. Sounds very posh. Um, and they are chocolate chip, double chocolate muffins. Core, sexy. They look nice, actually. Oh, now obviously not to be eaten just in one day, um, <laughs> but over a course of a few days, you know. Uh, but they do look nice. Mm, what's this? Two, three, all butter sweethearts. I don't know what that is, but maybe get it inside or something. I don't know. But yeah, so nice. Uh, chocolate chip cookies not cookies muffins sorry uh, next up got some hp sauce and uh, this was two pound because it is quite a big big size bottle um i do like some hp sauce this is for nathan though but i do have it i have this weird thing where i love putting um getting a plate putting a bit of hp sauce on it like a little dollop 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 getting a toast and then just like dipping it in if you've never tried it, try it. It's it's really nice. It's a very basic meal, but it's a meal and it's really nice. Okay, so, oh yeah, we have got another naughty treat. So we've got the chocolate muffins, right? But we've also got these blue riband, 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 I don't know, ribband. <laughs> yeah, um, chocolate bars. Um, how many calories does it say? 92, 92 calories. Not too bad, not too bad. Um, so they're from Poundland. And the last thing, the last thing to show you in this shopping haul um, are these box of uh, Capri Sun, orange Capri Suns. Nothing artificial about these. That's what it says on the box, that must be true. Um, there we go. So <laughs> you get four of them in this box. 
And I absolutely love Capri Suns. Um, uh, me and Nathan are going to go kind of half each on these because they're just lovely. Um, but whenever I was a kid, like in my little packed lunchbox my mum would make me for school, uh, she'd always put a little Capri Sun pouch in my lunchbox. Um, I had a Snoopy lunchbox. Well, I had loads of different lunchboxes, but one of them was Snoopy. And, um, yeah, I had a little Capri Sun orange. And, they, yeah, they're delicious. Anyway, I can't believe I spoke that long about Capri Sun. But um, take another look at this bag. It's a licorice all sorts bag. Have you ever seen such a cool bag? Maybe that's just me. I don't know. I'm really excited by that bag. Um, so there we go. That's the end of the video. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know in the comments section what you like the best. And don't forget, these two, oh, these two will be on eBay. So if you want the, uh, the pineapple or the llama, as I say, they're the big A3 poster size wall arts. Um, so let me know if, uh, obviously, they will be on my eBay available. So that's that. Uh, what else? What else? Oh, and yeah, I will be doing a separate video, as I say, with these solar lights, the flame effect lights. Honestly, if they look anything like they did on QVC shopping channel, I was like, oh, well impressed. I think you're going to love them. Um, so, yeah, look out for that video. I'll do that in the next few days. Um, but yeah, a lot cheaper in Poundland than online and stuff like that. So yeah all right everyone thanks for watching please click like comment subscribe to my channel don't forget to smash the notification bell and then you see when i've uploaded new videos and also when i'm doing live streams which i will be doing a live stream very very soon i promise i promise <sighs> what else uh minx merch is uh available now on teespring if you want some minx merchandise it is available now you look so hot you look so sexy you look so cool wearing a minx laura 123 t-shirt right and also, this is a true fact, if you drink your cup of tea or coffee out of a Minx Laura 123 mug, it tastes better. True fact. <laughs> so the link's down below to my merch shop. Um, what else? What else? Oh, Twitter. Come and follow me on Twitter, at Minx Laura 123. Instagram is at, no, yeah, Minx Laura 123 on Instagram. And uh, Minx Laura 123 ASMI is my other channel. Videos to help you sleep, relax chill out and get tingle tingle tingles uh, links down below to the other channel as well all right everyone thanks for watching let me know what you like the best out of all this big old shopping haul um and i like actually doing the shopping hauls in this kind of angle not having my face in it you know tell me if if this is all right do you mind me doing shopping hauls like this because I look really rubbish and I just, yeah, I, I put the phone down this way and you're not seeing my ugly mug. Um, but obviously, if you do prefer the old way where, you know, I'm sitting there in front of the camera, let me know. But I, I think it's pretty cool doing like this. And also you get a good look at everything in, in more detail, you know. Anyway, I'm rambling. I'm going to go. See you later, everyone. Take care of yourselves and those around you. Lots of love. Please subscribe. You know you want to.